females that's in a soft girl era, like, what made you transition back into your soft? But no, like, can we talk about it? Because I'm really sitting over here and I'm like, I never left my soft girl era. Now, it might have changed over time, but I never left a soft girl era. You know, sometimes my softness was roughness. My softness was fast paced. Like, softness does not. I was listening to the self love soul the other day, and she was saying everybody else's softness is different. And it really sparked me understanding that, like, just because I wasn't gentle doesn't mean I wasn't soft. It was just a different level of soft. It's just like some mothers, they grew up in the hood, so their mentality is more hard, more tough, because you got to be tough when you're in that type of environment. You got to be tough when you're in that type of neighborhood during that time, whatever time, whatever period. We're just using this as an example, because I don't believe you have to be tough your whole life. But again, toughness is two different things, because I could believe that toughness is this act of like, um, how can I say? I could believe toughness is climbing climbing a mountain, you know, and you could believe toughness is fighting, fighting people, being able to fight. Toughness is different. Softness is different. So I really don't think I have ever left soft girl era. I've just developed a, mm, I just developed a different comfort for the way that I view softness. But I've always been soft. <laughs> I ain't never left that bitch.